Hey guys, Dave here, coming at you from Easy Country Cooking and Cooking Share. Today we are making up an easy golden rice. Use it as a side dish or a main dish. Ever so good, you are simply going to love this and so will your family. So let me show you how to make this. So the first thing you want to do is grab off a couple of eggs and separate the whites from the yolks. What's that old saying? Separate the wheat from the chaff? I don't know, something like that. Now I'm using an egg separator, but you can use, you know, the yolk to yolk or hand to hand, whatever method you like. It's pretty easy to do. Then we are simply going to add those egg yolks to some pre-cooked rice that I cooked up the night before. You know, you can use Uncle Ben's package stuff, whatever you like. Just make sure it's a little bit cool because it is easier to work with. Season it up with a bit of salt, about half a teaspoon, a teaspoon, something like that. Then another half a teaspoon of the old garlic powder. Grab up the old spatula and simply mix this together and do it gently because you don't want to smush and mush that rice. Who wants pablum? And now you can see, guys, how yellow and golden it's getting from the egg yolks. That's exactly what you want. That's what we call it, yellow rice. Next up, throw some oil into a pan over medium-high heat. And this is, oh, I don't know, about a tablespoon, something like that. Just eyeball it. Throw in about three cloves of coarsely chopped garlic. And you know me and my garlic. I just have to have garlic and everything. Now in with a stalk or two of green onions that I've chopped up. And we'll just stir and saute this for a few minutes until that wonderful, wonderful, wonderful aroma of garlic fills the air. Then you know something's cooking. Alrighty then, go ahead and throw that rice in there. Oh, this is looking good. Golden grains of rice. Now for the protein, I am going to throw in about 10 or 12 shrimp. Give these a mix of rooney into the rice, and I mean, it doesn't have to be shrimp. It can be pork, bacon, beef, you know, as long as it's cubed fairly finely so it cooks up. Could even be the old spam for that matter. And you want to cook this for about three or four minutes until that shrimp is cooked through and that rice is heated up. But man, oh man, this is looking good, guys. I mean, even Coco thinks he wants some. Okay, let's shove this rice aside. Then in with those egg whites that ever been so patiently waiting on the sidelines there. You want to let the whites cook up for a couple of minutes until they begin to set. After that, grab up the old spatula and just kind of cut it up so it breaks up. Just like I'm doing ever so methodically. Just kidding. You guessed it, we're going to mix those egg whites in with the rest of the mixture just to make everything all complete and yummy-like. And really the great thing is this can be a side dish or you can just eat this on its own. But really, you know, there is something remotely satisfying of flipping and flopping rice around. I don't know, maybe I'm just a bit weird. Of course, now for the presentation part, we're just going to plate this up. But oh, doggies for crying in the ditch, this is looking good. Then to make it look all pretty like, we're going to garnish it up with some chopped up green onions. And this, my friends, pretty much tells the story of our easy and ever so delicious golden rice. And you pick this up and bite into it, guys. It is ever so good. And like I say, you can use it as a side dish, a main, whatever you like, but it is well worthwhile making. And if you do, leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. And don't forget to subscribe and give us a like because it does help the channel out. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay safe and catch you next time.